Hello, it's a chilly Pennsylvania fall day, but I'm going to take advantage of the remaining sunlight to uh, to show you the Singer sewing cabinet that I've refinished myself. Uh, it was made very likely in the late 1940s. Originally had a Model 66 from 1948 in it, so my guess is it was made in 1948 as well. Uh, I've uh, refinished it myself. As I uh, said, I've removed all the exterior stain in polyurethane. I uh, sanded it. I stained it and polyurethaned it uh, again, so I think it's a really great uh, cabinet for, for someone. So it'll fit a Model 66 or a Model 15, um, some of the 300 series, so I'll have the dimensions in the ad. Uh, my goal in the video is to really give you some close-ups on uh, what it looks like. If the road noise and wind cooperate, hopefully you can hear me. Uh, there's some uh, minor marks here and there, some things that aren't necessarily fixed from refinishing. You know, you see the light spots uh, there at the at the bottom. Uh, that's not an error, that's just kind of variations in the wood. And some parts of the wood accept uh, stain uh, better than others. But it really turned out well overall. There's a minor nick that uh, you can see. There's a piece of the wood that didn't accept stain as much as the others, so uh, I think it's a beautiful sewing surface overall, uh, but that's somewhat noticeable. With the lid, the support arm pops out like it should, and there's your, your sewing surface. So, some lighter spots uh, here and there. These may all seem minor to you, but I want you to be able to see what you're, what you're getting. so you can mount your machine on it. This uh, flips up so that you can put your machine uh, down in there and then you close that leaf and then close the lid down. So, give you a view of the inside. Sorry, make you seasick. Not much was really done to the inside, uh, but that's, that's it. I'll show you the inside of the storage area. It's a uh, really beautiful cabinet, very pleased with how it turned out. And uh, if you want other pictures or have any questions, just, uh, just let me know. Thanks.